Hi guys, in this video we'll be discussing synapses, reflexes, the reflex arc, and the example of a reflex arc, and finally a summary. Reflexes are things you do automatically without thinking about it. For instance, if you touch a hot pan, your hand moves away immediately. So we have things called neurons, which make up nerves, and these have gaps between them. These gaps are called synapses. So synapses are connections between neurons. So these two neurons are connected via a synapse. Neurons are really important as information is passed along them as electrical signals. In contrast, information is transferred across a synapse by chemicals or neurotransmitters, and these move or diffuse across the gap between neurons. So in this diagram, this is a neuron, and there is a neuron on either side of the synapse. So this gap is the synapse, and you can see there are lots of little red dots, and these are the neurotransmitters. This means that information is first passed along electrically along the neuron, then chemically along the synapse, and then electrically again along the neuron. Actually, transferring information by chemical signals is slower than electrical impulses, and this is because there's diffusion of these particles along the gap, and this takes time. So let's talk about a specific response to a stimuli, reflexes. Reflexes are very rapid responses and they don't require conscious thought. They're automatic or involuntary, so you don't know you're doing them. Hey guys, to continue watching this video and unlock hundreds of other super concise and exam board specific GCSE biology and combined science videos, just click the snap revised smiley face. Join me today and together let's make biology at GCSE a walk in the park.